We Got This Africa, proudly brought to you by Frytol. Frytol, you deserve to be well. <laughs> About 12 weeks ago, I invited some of my girlfriends to join me every week around this table to share some of our most emotional moments in life. I've always felt that us women need to talk more and say the things that happen to us and share so that when other people experience it, it won't be the first time they're hearing about it, but they'll actually have heard it from their sisters and their girls and we need to keep talking. So, We Got This Africa has come to you for the last 12 weeks and today we're wrapping up season one. And today on the show, I'd like to know if this show has been impactful to you at all. So I'm starting with my crew in-house. I have some of the most amazing people on this set. They're the people who make this show happen and Right after these messages, we'll get to meet my first three and we'll keep going and keep going and would like to hear from you too. My name is Nashako. You're welcome. Choosing the right oil makes all the difference. That is why I always choose Frytol. Mm. At Wilma, where Frytol is made, each and every worker wakes up with you in mind. Really? And for the millions of other homes too. There, the experts ensure every bottle of Frytol is rich with great tastes that creates memories to last their lifetime. Frytol is a cholesterol-free oil fortified with vitamin A. Now I know why you cook with Frytol. Yes, Dad. Enjoy great tasting meals with Frytol. Frytol. Love your food. Love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. You're watching We Got This Africa, the crew episode. And what's up? You know, it would be cool if we had something like we say and then we respond. We have something like, do we have something like that? Like a slogan. Yeah, we don't have anything. Do, do we? We got, got this. this. We have a song, right? We have a song. Come on, we have a song. Yes, we do. We have a song. We have a song. Yes, we do. But she'll give us a tune. What time is it? No, I mean, no, it's not <laughs> All right. Is your work hard? Really hard. Okay. But it's exciting. Yeah. You seem like the one who has the most fun around here. Um. It's it's ag arguable. <laughs> All right, Paula. Who are you? Um, I'm Paula, the production researcher. Okay, and you are. I'm Esther Asheki Womomansa, the makeup artist on set. Who makes us look good? Yep, yep. Look how and flawless my name look. is Nash Shakur. Mm -hmm. You are the, and the host. Hostess okay. with the mostest. Mm -hmm. And the hostess with the mostest. Yes, honey. Thank you very much. Wow. <laughs> so so how, how's, the episode, how's the season been for you guys? Okay, so for me, it's been quite insightful. It's been refreshing because, I mean, I'm in the industry and I see the content being churned around, you know, churned out on a daily basis. And sometimes I wonder. So this is like a breath of fresh air. Ah. Mm -hmm. Glad you think so. Yes, I, I'm I glad you think so. Yeah, she's she's like um the <laughs> the you know it producer in town. Mm. You know, we're not a big show. So mm. we are privileged to have her on the show. <laughs> yeah, very privileged to have you. Thank you so much for agreeing to do this. Like thanks for really grateful to um, you. Thanks for making me a part of this. Yeah, I'm, I'm very happy you're here. She was my senior in school. She was the one oh, with the wow. chiches. You know, you know the chiches. Mm. Like, What's chiches? Chiches. Yeah, like, like, you know, like, yeah. yeah. Mm. Don't talk to me. Yeah. Hey. So, <laughs> I'm, I'm flabbergasted. I said, oh, you are. Mm. You're quite perplexed, are you? <laughs> so, so, yeah, I'm really glad you're on, you're on here. You've been really awesome, yeah. you know. Thank yes. you. And, and my guest tell me how, how you speak before. Say, say what she said. Mm -hmm. um, say what she said. What she yeah. call you? So we just want to know, I want to know um, some of the, your life experiences so I get to know your perspective on this whole show. Mm. And I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Okay. Can I put out? Okay. Hey. Oh. So, do you so have I'll any regrets? You. Do you have any regrets? My <laughs> Rhonda, I haven't told you, eh? Mm. So my guest, right, mm -hmm. tell me that, so they're like, who was the one that called me? It's like, why, what happened? Mm. Because she called me, she was speaking a lot of English. English. <laughs> oh, like, do you have any regrets in life? Mm. What's your perspective of this matter? <laughs> I'm like, really? <laughs> That's not true. So, 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 um, so, Miss, uh, um, Miss Drew, right, mm -hmm. she has a British accent. Yeah. So when she, when she came around and she was telling me that she called her, and she said in a British accent, and I could feel it. <laughs> I, I, I can feel like yeah, that's Rhoda, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But you do, you do, you do, you do. I'm glad to say to you. How about you? How's it been? So um, this show has been very, very informative. Information, the information that I've heard from all the beautiful women that have been on the show, it's been amazing. Especially um, this one episode about infertility. I was stunned, uh, like to hear those women. You know, now they're on the other side, they have kids and they're happy, but to hear them share their experience, it was like therapy session for me. And just their resilience and the strength, it was so, so touching. So yeah, I've been blessed to be on this show and to do y'all's makeup. Yes. yes. It's been, it's it been gave awesome. Me hope, actually. That yes. is so good. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. 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 yeah, the resilience was just, yeah. And one thing I've been really grateful for is how much the women are able to share yeah. without holding any information back and that's what we really needed and you know yeah. what that's because you're such a good host oh, now, oh, round of applause, oh. Anna. Because, yeah because you're honestly. able to connect with your your audience should i say audience or the pe the person you're interviewing and it's like you're able to just draw that thing out of them and it's, oh. you don't get that with every host so well, well thank done you. Now. all in favor say aye Aye. Aye. Thank you. Yes, now it's 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 key you. we mentioned that because a lot of the times you find people very bubbly, very outgoing, mm -hmm. but once they get into a studio setting and the cameras are turned on, especially the lights, it, yeah. it makes a lot of people feel intimidated and they yeah. quell up. Mm -hmm. yeah. But you I don't think there's been an episode that has even started on a slow note because yeah. often oh. producers we think that okay. We start, we pick up, yeah. then we climax. Yes. But a lot of a lot of the times it's momentum, boom, right from get go, and then we flow through. For a few heavy topics that we had, it's to be expected. Mm -hmm. But it was so I was glued, even though I had to be working. A lot of the times Otobia, my assistant, forgets to keep the time. Hmm. <laughs> she was like she's listening. Chuka, 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 <laughs> she's chuka, listening chuka. and then she's keeping the time. The hmm. time you know, the clock like hits before you pin, know it and she doesn't even realize because you're, so, yes, you're listening. she's she's listening with rapt attention so mm. I, it makes me wonder okay so if this is on air i can start to calculate the numbers Number, yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that's good for you. okay um it's been good so far i think that the pre-production stage was everything that went on during the pre-production stage was worthwhile because the thought process, who are we supposed to have on this show, what topics are we supposed to treat, mm -hmm. who suits this topic. Yeah. I think that the team you put together was awesome. I think that the ideas that came up right. and how everyone sat down and decided that, okay, this is how this show is, is going to run mm -hmm. was beautiful. I am enjoying the production stage and I know, I, I know everyone is going to enjoy it. I'm enjoying it. I mean, when, the sh when we are recording, everyone seems to watch as though they are sitting at home and they are not in the studio yeah. space. Yeah. Everyone like just zooms out mm -hmm. yeah. of this Even place. Even the and guys, the, the, yeah. the, the, the technical guys. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. I, think, I think that's what makes it beautiful. I think that's what makes it yeah. different from... Mm -hmm. any other show I've seen. Yeah. And I'd like, to, I'd like us to talk to more of our crew members to find out exactly, especially how the episodes have been and which episodes we remember the most. Ashaki started us off, so we're going to look at all of the episodes, the ones we remember, what we learned, and we'll get to meet some more of our crew members. You're watching We Got This Africa. And let us also know how this season has been for you and how we can make next season better.
Feels great to have a hearty, healthy family. Frital Sunflower Cooking Oil. Also cholesterol free for tasty, healthy meals. Love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. You're watching We Got This Africa. It's a show for us girls to come on here and talk and share our experiences and our hopes that will help other women out there. Now, on this episode, I'm hanging out with my crew to just point out how this season has been for them. And most importantly, I'd like to hear from you too. Let us know how we can make next season better and what you liked and did not like about this season. So, I'd like us to now welcome up on stage, on set, <laughs> our PA Extraordinaire, Ali. Ali, 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 Angel, you can sit, you can sit. Angel, what's up? Angel is shy. Are you shy? Yeah, A little much. bit. How are you doing? Fine, by the grace of God. <laughs> so, so, what do you do on, on the set? I am your PA, of you course. You are my PA. <laughs> We're the most. Yeah, so I just help organize Na Shakur to get ready for the show and everything. Yes. That's and great. make sure everybody is in a good mood. Mm. Yes, yeah. yes. And you've been really awesome. Thank you. Have I been annoying? No, not at all. Oh, <laughs> speak about <laughs> it. It's a moment. I, okay. I, 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 just say, just say, mm. have I been annoying? A little. <laughs> your job is as Have I been but <laughs> Your job is all part of the job. <laughs> I've been difficult eh? Yeah, but it's all part of the job. I'm sorry, okay. Don't worry. You know I love you, right? I love mm -hmm. you like, too. Like, like, it's deep, deep. <laughs> deep. I but love I, you too. Oh, oh, oh. Hug. <laughs> so, how has the season been for you? Have you, do you remember or recall any episodes where you learned anything? This season has been wonderful. I learned a lot of things about women because I'm young. As you know, yeah, we are old. Maybe you don't know. We <laughs> <laughs> don't know. We don't know. Nineteen. So, oh, women go through these things. Have taught me a lot that you should be strong. You shouldn't let the circumstances in life determine how you react to situations. You know, I feel cheated. Why? Why didn't I have this in my yeah, teens, yeah. like late like teens, know. Or even twenties? I think you are very blessed. See, yeah. The day I was sitting there producing the episode um, with Drew, yeah. and I was like, uh, that was oh, so we just went through life like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why? Yeah. Can we go back and I redo know. it? I think it's really amazing that at nineteen you have an opportunity like this to to even work on a project like this and meet all of these wonderful so women. So even work in the first place. Yes. Yeah, work in the first place. I so. think so too. I think yeah. I'm really blessed to get this opportunity. Aww. We love you. <laughs> love you guys too. <laughs> Alright, let's meet somebody else. Somebody else. Who has a mic? Hey, Who has a mic? Infodi! One picture, one picture. One picture. Everybody okay. say for the Alright, come come come. Is she say who's the picture? Hey, this picture. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, just a flash. Okay, okay. No, I can't show it to you. I'll show it to you. Like it. Here, here. So how's it been for you? I mean, by the way, for this our muscle on the set, you know, he does all the heavy lifting. You know. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but he's like, okay. Tell us who you are and what you do. Okay, I'm Gilbert and. Um, I'm a photographer. Okay. Behind the scenes, I take the shots behind the yes. scenes. Yeah. All the pretty pictures we put on Facebook <laughs> and Instagram. Yeah. How has the season been for you? Um, I think it's been cool so far. Okay. My favorite episode was um, the parenting side. Okay. Where you're talking about the strictness. With my mothers. And yeah. Mm. I like that part a lot and I learned a lot. 
Okay. I think things have changed now, so. So how would you be <laughs> a different parent now? I don't know, but. How old are you? I'm 23. 23, okay. Yeah. Do you hope to be a parent one day? Yeah. Okay, Hopefully. and what kind of parent would you be after <laughs> everything that, in fact, on that episode, I was so schooled. Who else felt very schooled? For me, I went like, yes. Hey. Yes. I couldn't talk her. Mm -hmm. And as for, as for, um, I'm already mad. She wasn't allowing me to talk at all. Mm -hmm. Like, it was like, oh, don't. <laughs> so, so, so you realize that I kept Point in I mean, you were to trying to tell me to talk to the I want to talk to the community. But I remember him I had a show, she was like, I have so much to say, you just, this this children this are this Listen, see I'm into the money now. Charlie, but I was so schooled on that episode. Yeah. So, so what kind of parents are you going to be? Mm. Mm. I don't know. Mm. You're so young. Mm. Mm. When we get there, you cross. Yeah. Yeah. When, we there, when we get there, we'll cross. We but for me, that episode, reassured me of some of the decisions I've had to take for my teen. Okay. And you I have a teenager? Yes. Okay. So I remember the day we were talking about um, the phone. And yeah. everybody was trying, like a lot of the ladies were trying to be, oh, auntie, she begs. Oh, this <laughs> one she begs. And I'm like, no. I think that even if you put your daughter in such, or your child in such a check, when she steps out, the influences around her might do it. Unbeknown to her, or sometimes... Because they're doing it, she might get involved. So it's fine. We'll share a, a desktop or a laptop at home. We'll share a tablet. But for me to give you phone with <laughs> internet, <laughs> uh-uh. It's no. not going to happen. Mm. Mm. It's, it's a very, I beg your pardon, it's a very tough decision mm. to make in this day and age where all her friends will have it. You know, it mm. can work both ways. She might either be influenced into trying to get some, mm -hmm. yeah. you know, however she can get it. Mm -hmm. Or she might just be a, you know, a mommy's girl and obey mommy's rules, but she'll still feel left out. Yeah. You know, and that, that can, you know, it's, it's tricky. I don't know, man. Why does it have to be so hard? Mm -hmm. Because I know some parents who will not give their three-year-old tablets to watch Coco Melon or anything of the sort because they, want, they don't want to give them more screen time because mm -hmm. there's all this talk about children becoming zombies yeah. mm -hmm. because they're always like this. Yeah, and they are not learning human interaction. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, the the key to everything is balance. Once yeah. you find your That's balance, right. yeah, yeah, That's a, where the real struggle is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Find the balance. All right, let's meet some more of our crew. We need to swap mics. Can you guys like swap your mics with Andre? Thank you for for coming. Yay! Thank you, Ali, Ali, Ali. Uh, so you does that does to be doing behind the scenes. Hey. <laughs> All right, so. The that's what she's been doing behind the scenes. She's hiding them. So mm. we are going to talk to Andre and only Andre. Who else? Is gonna, my, and, and, my, and, and, my people are shy. And no, who? Director. Oh, director. Hi, director. Hi, director. Hi, director. <laughs> hey, Hi. the kind of discussions that are currently going. Can we see what's, what's happening? What, can, <laughs> Jim, can we see what's happening over there? The can we see what's happening over there? <laughs> Jim, uh -huh. Jim. Uh -huh. well, makeup is on the set. The makeup artist is here, so if you want makeup, so, please come well, over here for your while makeup. While um, <laughs> on the episode where the mothers were on, you were on with the mothers, then director was like, hey, so I now understand. So he says he went to visit his mom after a long break, mm -hmm. and um, just when he was approaching, the mom says, "Hey, are we still rolling? Are we still rolling? We're not rolling. Beard gang. Hi. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. Beard gang. Yeah. It's like so. He, he was like, he felt like a child again. Yeah. Mommy, we pa. How about the side? No. Sure. It's all this bitch. Hey. By the way, this is Stephanie. Yeah. And she's my sister. Yeah. And she says, <laughs> And she doesn't have a mic, <laughs> but she's giving us food. Thank Yay. you. <laughs> and she can also dance. Go, Staffy. Go, Staffy. Go, Staffy. Go, Staffy. Go, Staffy. <laughs> All right, director. Applaud the say, director. Applaud the say, Andre. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hello. And they sit beside me. Okay. How's it been? How's it been? Okay, let's meet you guys. Who are you? What do you do? Um, okay, so I'm L, Emmanuel L. Agri, okay. assistant director. Yeah, the director himself is not here. Yes. Enoch. Um, so I'm assisting 
but my role itself is uh, production management so i managed production yeah okay and how's it been it's been awesome um it's been awesome content wise um technical everything facilities and everything Yay. i'm loving it seriously and you made it happen yeah so go on you. thank <laughs> you <laughs> andre how's it been what's up the way um, wait, so wait far. what'd you do okay so i'm andronicus and then no, no, you didn't uh, tell uh, us that no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> That's 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 yeah. yeah. Your so name my real name is Andronikos. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Wow. It's, it's Nokos your, your last your last name. No, Andronikos is one, is one, one name. name. Yeah. Okay, and your last name is what? So Jacobs. Andronikos Jacobs. Yeah. I'm a Ghanaian. Wow. That's a very nice name. Yeah. Okay. What do you do? So I'm a camera operator here, and so far so good. Okay. I enjoyed the program. Is there any episode that, you know, struck you like oh Yeah, cerebral palsy. I okay. hope I got it right. Yeah, yeah. cerebral palsy. Yeah, what so, about it? So seeing uh, mothers go to give birth and then they coming out having their kids, you know, disabled or something like yeah. that. It's it's very touching. Waking up every morning to see your kid. You know, not, not be like normal that, like any normal kid. Yeah. yeah. It's so touching. It was a very emotional episode for me. Yeah. Yeah. It was. It was. Yeah. It was, but the, let me tell you the trick. The the guests never made it feel like yeah. that. Yeah. Because I remember you on countless t uh, occasions saying, look at her, she's always laughing. And yeah, look at no. you, you're always smiling. Yeah. yeah. They, 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 like, they were really that kind of woman that, you know, we really need in yeah. our times. Mm -hmm. They embodied that kind of woman. Yeah, I, I remember I was so anxious ahead of that shoot because yeah. I didn't know how yeah. I was going to... I, 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 was, I yeah. was too, because I... Then uh, the thought of handling kids came to mind because mm -hmm. I have a little girl, just mm. worth 11 months. Oh, wow. Aww. 11 months, yes, thank you. So I was like, what's going to happen to my girl? Yeah. <laughs> You know, so I, I really happen. felt it. I really yeah. felt it. And one other episode that got me, I, I even shared a bit, uh, was the, um, the um, what's it called? Miscarriages. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I, I, it got me thinking. And I remembered when my wife went through two miscarriages. I'm and so on the, the second one, she was in bed, uh, the hospital bed, and she was like, Okay, so Kofi, can you take pictures of this? I was like, this is no joke, please. <laughs> oh. I can't do this, please. Don't, don't joke with certain things. Yeah. And she was like, look, it's, it's gone. We hoping for the best. And the third time it, got, it, was, it happened out. Wow. I mean, it was yeah. a miracle. Third time? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. For me, that, that episode got me thinking, what else can we do to improve our health Healthcare. system yeah. here? Yeah. Because yeah, my nice sister issue. was carrying triplets yes. and she, so she, she was doing something and her first locked the door behind her. So she had to jump over the wall, pregnant, you know, to be able, because the kid was crying and the key is that the gate is earlock. Yeah, I think she pushed the bin outside for the truck to pick. And so the gate shut. So she jumped. And then at night, I was called that the husband actually fainted. So he woke up and on the bed, it was all clots. And oh my God. sister, when, when she's pregnant, sleeps naked. It was all clots. So my brother-in-law fainted. So I rushed in, drove her to a very popular and very good hospital here in Accra. And the doctor said, said prepare her for theater. We're good. We have to clear everything. Mm. I don't know. So I called my senior most sister and she says, no, let's bring her here. Meet me here. And then she mentioned another hospital. We got there and it was just one that had been ruined. The twins are, Nanakojo and Nanajua are 13, 14 now. Wow. wow. Yeah. So imagine the other doctor would have just Taking ripped them everything out. Exactly. out. And it's even the language, clear everything. Yeah, clear. Everything. I don't say that. So, so I don't, it, it just shook me. And my sister was at work. I said, no, I'll call her out of duty. In my situation, it, it was midnight. It was <laughs> midnight. So imagine driving all the way from West Hills Mall to airport area just for a nurse to attend to us. And it wasn't as if they, they were not aware. I phoned them. My wife also phoned. 
we consistently were calling, telling them that this is the situation. So we're on our way. Prepare a bed for us. Get us ready. We got there and the doors were locked. And I mean, the nurses were like, I feel they are sorry. We'll be high end that. I was like, really? Wow. You guys are joking with life here. Yeah. Wow. It's like they say it all the time, so now they, they don't have any yeah. emotion. That hospital where the kids were saved, I, I have never, even if I sneeze unusually, I run there because so. they're such, I feel they're yeah. so different. Some of our hospitals, you know, it, it, they can break your heart. Yeah. 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 And they yeah. can ruin you. Yeah. yeah. And shout outs to the doctors and the nurses and the midwives who go all out to make sure yeah. that they give the best care, especially to expectant mothers and families and children mm -hmm. because, you know, at that time you had your most vulnerable and mm -hmm. you need the very best yeah. you can get. So when, you know, you, you go to a hospital and they are not giving you 100% care okay. and you don't know what to do, mm -hmm. it can be very frustrating. Yeah. Yeah. Very. But we're getting Shall too we? emotional. Oh. <laughs> What's that? I, know. I, I enjoyed, I enjoyed the, the parenting part as well, the episode. I yeah. saw you guys yeah. agreeing. <laughs> no, you, are you guys wearing skinny jeans? I remember when um, the, the other woman, or him, or him Adria, uh, yeah, yeah, she mentioned, I, I don't entertain a fiesta in my house. I was like, <laughs> 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 okay, Ma, I can't be in your house. <laughs> but but, the but it is, it's very serious. Because mm -hmm. I remember, um, even at my age, I'm getting to 40. And I remember about some few years back, I made a mistake in life. And I went to my mom. And my mom had to slap me. Gave mm. me a dirty slap. I said, yes, this is coming from the old age. Yeah. Mm. I didn't complain because I know I'm at fault. I was mm. at fault. And mm. that was it. I, I really took it, kept quiet, and then walked away. Mm. Yeah. So, my you know, um, <laughs> my dad will tell you this. You know, when you get married and then you mess up, I will slap you in front of your wife. Oh, my you God. You deserve it. it. You deserve it. So, yes, as family, wow. yeah. now coming to do knocking, to marry my sister, and my mom says, my sister was disrespectful or something. In front wow. of the illos. Like that. Oh, that Ooh, you are not a sub, Bobby. Wow. Charlie, that's next level. <laughs> yeah. She said she had to do it. Even if they didn't um, feel disrespected or feel offended, they would go with the impression that she's been trained yes. and so her yeah. mess is not yeah. the, the parents yeah. mess mm. yeah and I, for me i think it's it's something that i i really i really mm. enjoy i have a lot of mothers in my life mm. uh, from church especially so i really respect you know motherhood so my little girl when she does something i just look at her with an eye and she will just 11 months she would just look at me somewhere and then she'll keep quiet and one thing funny thing is the moment she starts misbehaving and i'll sing i'll buy jai mary you know i'll buy jai mary and she she go calm at 11 months I'm telling you <laughs> and when the mom does same when the mom sings that song she will turn with an eye okay. and look at her song. Okay. i hate this song uh, wow. oh <laughs> but now let's admit it I think you're so blessed because almost everyone on this team, on this production, so believes in Jesus and so yeah. believes yeah. in yeah. prayer. Yeah. 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 So I remember a few, so a few times we couldn't pray. I could hear, I, I couldn't turn, but I could hear somebody praying behind us mm -hmm. wow. coming from the guys. So yeah. I'm like, okay. That's awesome. They've, they've yeah. got us. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. The yeah. men have got us when, you know, yeah. we're so busy and we forget. And the fact that when guests talk about Christ and their spiritual side mm. and everybody goes nodding. I'm like, okay, this mm. is gratifying because yeah. the bit where um, Ashaki in an episode said that one of the things I think she felt she had done different, mm. she should have done differently was know Christ earlier. Yeah. A lot of us say same. I'm in my mid thirties and mm -hmm. sometimes I feel like, okay, I think I should have, it's not, I, I have always been around the church. My dad was a military man turned lay preacher. You know, my godfather now is a pastor under whom I serve. Mm -hmm. As a, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm his PA and I'm on the oh, media team okay, as well. Okay. So 
every time I feel, so I've been in this space all this while, but I can tell you ex maybe like the last five years is when, when I hit 30 was when I started taking mm -hmm. the oh, spiritual so life seriously. Mm -hmm. And I, f I, f I felt like a lot of people go through it. Yeah. Um, one of the ladies even said same when you were treating the 30s episode. Adulting or? Y yes, the adulting okay. episode. Those, the, the things we, we wish we knew. Yeah, so in our 30s. Then the, the, the guest was in there said, said same. She's like, yeah. Um, her advice is that people should take their spiritual life, you know, seriously, seriously yeah. at an early age. And I think it was a, a, a deal breaker yeah. for yeah. the season. You know, this show has taken my respect for women to a different level. Yeah. Yeah. Seriously. Woo! Seriously. Woo! 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 And I must congratulate you for that. Oh, you know, thank you, Andre. Yes, thank <laughs> you. Especially thank the episode you. where you told you, you gave us a story. Yes, that was very, very brave. Touching. Very touching. Okay. That was the and, first time ever, right? Uh, yeah. Coming public. And you see, with it. I mean, you go to. I've been at the labor ward before, so I know what happens there, and it's it is not easy. It's it is no joke. Please don't joke with it. Yeah. So I I could relate. Okay, mm -hmm. I could relate. Sam, what is the time? We did welcome the bloggers. Oh, to be not checking the time. <laughs> <laughs> she's, she's we, have three, we have three minutes more. She's oh lost. We've done 33 minutes. Okay. Okay. So we have 33 minus 30, 45. <laughs> so you have 12. 12, 12 we have 12 minutes, minutes yeah. more. Mm -hmm. Hey, let's talk to more people. More people, mm -hmm. more people, more people. Hey, mm -hmm. see how people are getting lost. <laughs> the hey, and the where's girls? Gina? Come on. Where's Gina? Bring Gina. So, <laughs> so Gina's that valid. woman is phenomenal. Yeah. Which woman? Gina. 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 She would do anything and everything to get you what you want. Get a mic. Get Andre's mic. I don't eat white bread. This woman made me eat white bread. Oh, 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 oh. me. But the way she talk about the bread and the food. Uh, uh, fresh. Hey, what? Oh, thank you. God bless you. Please, if you want your production to be managed well without excess budgets, when it comes to catering, she's your woman. All the guys appreciate it. They, they always come in. They said, Oh, I'm not even on the front. Oh, my man, the fans, my man, the fans. But I never saw her eat herself. Are you on that? I, <laughs> I eat papa. Really? Are you sure? Because nobody sees you. Sure. The bank. Why yeah. people are I'm busy enjoying myself? Oh. You know, really? Yeah. We don't see you. She's eating. really a mother. Yeah. yeah, she feeds her kids before. Of yeah. course. I have oh, five children. Have we? Have we given? Oh, wow. <laughs> She's shedding me. <laughs> <laughs> She's shedding because take your shade. two of those five are mine. Like, uh, <laughs> take it. Collect your shade. I'm collecting my shade. But how has the production been? Have we stressed you out or? Mm. Everyone is nice. I love the team. Okay. Oh God. The, uh, I, I, actually, this is my first time, but I don't know. I don't know what to say. I'm speechless. Oh, wow. that's how you make me feel. Yeah. <laughs> when I'm with you, all is possible. Mm. And I just like, I nothing is she fun. doesn't worry when we are running late yeah she doesn't worry when we are too early yeah I, sometimes i felt so ashamed. she's always so calm i just wanted she bought me watching oh yeah hmm. She gave everybody tea and gave she me watch it. She gave me two eggs. <laughs> oh, wow. She gave me eggs. tea and gave me watch it. So, 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 is, is there anything? But she forgot to give me bacon today. She didn't give you what? Bacon. 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 I remember that story. Oh, you like it, Chichoe. Bacon. 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 But we appreciate you so much, Gina. Thank, thank you. And thank you for being so good to thank us. Thank you, Mom. All right. I like your makeup. It's really nice. <laughs> Ketsi. Yay! <laughs> oh, uh, thank you so much. Thank Gina. you. Bless you. Bye. Bye. So we have we're getting Derek on. Derek. Go Derek. Go Derek. Go Derek. Go Derek. Charlie, you know busy. Not the business. Derek, that's Derek. That's Derek. Ah. Oh, Derek. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh, look at the white hair.
Come, 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 come. Ah, you hold it. Show them for the shoot. I beg you, show them for the shoot. I beg you, show them for the shoot. Yes. Come and show us the white shirt. The white chapel. Oh, but you've been around the last. Come and come show us your white shirt and khaki trousers. For today, you've been around. Gally, Gally, Gally. Yeah, yeah. Derek, how's it been? Ah, it's been fun. Yeah? Oh, it's fun. Share a bit of the fun. I don't know, but I think I joined in late. But the part I joined in and I enjoyed was when everybody was speaking from the heart. Because I think they were talking about childbirth. And we have too much stigma about Daben Aube, and it's, it's running through marriages and stuff. So today I was blessed. Awesome. Well, we're blessed to have you here. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and thank you for being very encouraging and such a, a good sport. Mm -hmm. Number six. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm speaking from my heart. Okay. Is that heart? You? you don't believe it. Oh, it's true, it's this is my serious face. Okay, serious, man. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> like, like, I'm pouring from my from the depth of my heart. Yeah. So. Hey. Thank you so much. We appreciate you. Any episode one, Nami will have the answer. Maybe table will be amount. Yeah. Maybe money. Is that it? Yes. Yeah, so. uh, I, I think I'm happy seeing faces I know already. Yeah. yeah. I read the hair so many years back, like yeah. eight years ago. You read about hair? No, I read the hair. Oh, yeah. Take it to the street. Yeah, for us. Oh, yeah. And I've worked it. Yeah, thank you. Yes. Yeah, she was you on the same project too. And I'll work with you. You will work with me. Yes. Okay, that's fine. Yes. In the future, in the future, in the future. If only take a picture, please. <laughs> Right now, you go and do two and say, So, five. <laughs> All right, thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I'm the only so, one drinking my thing. I finished it. Oh, wow. I finished it. You got so, it. So, so I think, it yeah, up. I think that's it for this episode. Yeah. And what can I say? Thank you so much for being a part, like watching this show, always commenting about it, always sharing it, and keeping us on top. We are very grateful. And next season, we promise to bring you an even better show. Yeah. And so, can we meet everybody? Everybody! Why Gina? Why Gina to come? WGT! Everybody, 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 and thank you so much for watching for all of us all of you we got this i'm gonna say i'm gonna say it alone three two one we got it Proudly brought to you by Frytol. Frytol, you deserve to be well.